Welcome back to Timberborn, guys and gals, and thank you for all the subscribers and commenters and people liking. We are still having the mouse problems, but I'm going to, to try to work through it and uh, maybe have to replace it or something. I'm not sure. We've got a day to the drought, but I think we built a couple more water tanks, and apart from... Waiting on berries. We are okay. We've got actually 42 berries. I don't know exactly where they came from. But, um, we're actually doing okay. We're doing okay. Actually, we need, we need all the, all the harvesting we can get. I don't know if we're going to run out of, um, water again tomorrow. <laughs> The next, you know, the next day in game. So I'm going to harvest as many carrots as I can because we're always running out of food. And then, um, hopefully, you guys need to focus on carrots, obviously. But we do have some sunflower seeds, four of them. People are eating those immediately for some reason. But the drought's starting. Uh, we didn't finish the, the levee as, as I had hoped, but I think water-wise we're going to be okay. So I'm going to pause a couple of these just to slow down um, losing all the water to the tanks. The tanks are all full, basically, right? Yeah. So that will be most helpful. If we can just get all these carrots in, then we can replant to turn this guy on and get um, put some potatoes harvested. Just don't have anybody to do that right this second. We could pause, actually, we could go down to one of the, um, one builder. Oh, we are down to one builder. Well, <laughs> we really don't need planks being made right this second. So there we go. So, yeah, this should be good, I think. Let's have these guys replant, and we'll put another guy in there to help. Perfect. Oh, that means that there's still not a guy doing potatoes? Well, we want somebody doing potatoes. We'll collect all the potatoes, and then we will... I mean, as much as we can. We can only collect 50 at a time. And then we'll throw a... Uh, we'll throw in a cook to process them. I don't know. I think this drought... Oh, it is 12 and a half days. Which to some, might not be very long. We do have a bunch of maple. And we could make maple pastries. Is that... It's in the grill, right? No. It's in the... You know, we have to do a lot. <laughs> we have to... We have to make flour from, like, cattails or wheat. There is some room in the water to get some, like, spatterdack, maybe. So, that might be something to consider in the near future. How do we... We have one guy still that isn't working? Why? Oh, because we had a, uh, a baby grow up. Okay. Well, that is good news. Let's, um... Where do we want to put this guy? Oh, he might need to start cooking. How many do we have? Eleven? Takes five logs? Sure. Start cooking some delicious potatoes, please. Because the uncooked... So we get... We get one potato per lot, per plot. Right? But one potato... Is, um... Four baked potatoes. So he obviously cuts it into quarters and grills it. Um, this one's going to be potato. Which is there. This one's going to be grilled potatoes. Cool. Oh, that means this guy... Okay, so we're going to raise this up. And I... We can raise it to the top. Right? 
yes, we might even rebuild it soon. But until then, uh, we'll leave it. Water is at 600, food is at 486, and the water table is okay. So we'll keep on with one pump for now. Um, yeah, I think we're okay. We've got one job, somebody died of old age. That's unfortunate, but it's gonna happen. Oh, our next batch of carrots is coming in, and we still are at 600. We are down to 10 beavers, I mean. How much water they drink really i do want to unlock gears or get gears going but we need uh several more planks which we will get to someday in 10 days hopefully we'll have enough beavers to start you know repopulating the repopulating everything let's change this back to planting Yeah, everything seems to be okay. Let's put this down to one. And good. Every job that I want to be happening is happening. And this should be on planting, right? Yes. And this is on harvesting. This is on planting. Good. Why are we putting carrots in here? I don't know. Because our carrot storage is getting very close to being done, maybe? Who knows? Alright, what's next? What, what are we building next? Does this need planks? Yeah, everything needs planks. We need a couple of beavers to uh, to run on the treadmill. And we've got... Oh, another guy dying of old age. We've got three baby beavers on the way. And we've got lots of campfires. Rooftops. I know that's... A thing. We actually have more than enough science for all this stuff so if we did like a two by three three by two does that matter okay um we can put rooftops on top of like the the dwellings right up here i think so let's get um we'll get a path why would we put a path here? Well, because we can put... Could have put more houses. But... Now we can't. Okay, we need to let more water out. That's fine. Just let it all out. Don't want stuff to die. We've got eight more days. Let's pause this guy. For now. I think 600 water is enough. To, um... To survive. Right? Most likely. Let's uh, see if we pause this action. I like the teamwork of harvesting and planting at the same time. I just do. So I'm going to leave it like that. What do we want? Oh, well, someone died of old age, so there's nothing we can do currently. We will have more berries coming up. Let's get, I guess we turn that on. People are dying faster than, than anything else. It would be nice to get gears, but we need planks. Oh, we have two people that need jobs? Please, start making planks. Make some planks. Well, tomorrow. Make some planks tomorrow. Uh, now that we've drained that, let's remember to put it all the way back up. All the way back up. Alright. Seven days exactly until this drought ends. And, um, which is good. It needs to be, it needs to end. Could get more, another guy in the potato area. It really takes forever. Six days to get one potato. Or four days to get three carrots that don't have to be cooked. You know, kind of, uh, you know. Why is, oh, this one's not too far because of 
their reasons, but... We just do something like this, and like that. Maybe put the stairs like this and like that. It's ridiculous, I know. What do, what do we need? I never even checked. Oh, it takes planks. Okay, well. It is what it is. The roofs are, are optional, you know? Put a platform he down here. We shouldn't have done that. We could have put storage underneath. Hmm. <laughs> well, what was I thinking? You know, this guy, he could use help. Let's give him some help. Let's grill all the potatoes we can grow. And what else? What are we waiting on? We're just waiting on the drought to end. We got a plank. Fortunately, we've got... We've got a lot of plank projects, so... Yeah. It's gonna be, uh... Maybe something else. Do we need to put down... A couple of... Levees or damned levees to stop water from flooding next season. I don't want five days to come in and then find out that we've totally screwed up. But... We'll see. We will see. Building lacks power. No, it doesn't. We're just, we're just waiting patiently. Three buildings lack materials, of course. We'll get that. What is this, a plank an hour? Just about. Planked every hour and a, and a third. So, yeah. We need to store power, would be the next thing. Like, up here, we could put some batteries. But... That's, that's for another time. If I could just <laughs> learn to do this game better. More water storage and that kind of thing. Maybe everything would be fine. Maybe we go up. Like if we did a set of stairs here and a set of stairs here. And then start building this even taller. I know we're kind of at the limits of walkability. But we put a path all the way around here. And uh, just built this giant levee. Maybe. Maybe this is a good And then, I mean, this is just wood, right? Yeah, it's just logs. So, uh, we would have to do this a very specific order. And I know you don't have to overlap the, the levee, but I hate the water. Um flowing in between the cracks of the of the levee. Does that make sense? I know you've seen it before where it um, just kind of flows between the cracks and it's not really flowing but it kind of is. I hate that. <laughs> well, that was unnecessary. There. We do that. And then we put them. Um... Some floodgates, bigger, the bigger floodgates at the end. We'll see how far that gets us. Um, oh, we've got a, a, a spare beaver. A beaver that needs work. And we've got two days left. And we've got 400 water. We've seven, 800 food. Potatoes are growing and being grilled. We don't have any spare potatoes, which means they're being grilled at a right old... Oh, wow. We actually need more storage. And I don't know why I did this like this. I think I'm going to delete these and put... S delete these two and put storage back down. Let's do this. So... Medium warehouse here and here. We get those two built and then we, we get rid of 
Well, we can get rid of this one and get rid of that. And then we'll put the storage below. And this will be potatoes. And then um, we can put grilled potatoes on top. You know, we actually we'll make actually if we make this grilled potatoes and then empty this storage. That's what we'll do. All in good time though. The drought ends in one more day. All the excitement of the beavers when the drought ends. You know, just just so much excitement. able to reach all this cool okay I like it I think we can I think we can get that done you know in a few in a few years hey we did something uh, because of the roof maybe I don't know just don't know and here comes the waters in just a day please beavers be okay for just a day you know we're getting our population back up slowly we're gonna have a giant dam eventually. I've got this guy doing absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing. Oh, we got three people that need jobs. Okay, this is gonna be, we're gonna be putting more carrots up here. We're gonna need, um, this guy is gonna be doing blueberries, which comes right down to it. I don't really need him doing anymore. What else can a forester do? I mean, could get chestnuts grilling. Is it just grilling? Can I do that in here? Yeah, we can get chestnuts. So, chestnut tree. Takes about uh, 24 plus 32 days or so, but that's okay. Let's get a few chestnuts growing, like this many. That many chestnuts. And then maybe we turn on this guy to get carrots, or do we not even bother with this guy anymore? You can never have too many carrots, right? Alright. Um, and then we're going to need this on. And this paused. I don't like that that's... Oh, this is... New. Why did that happen again? That's just a temporary mishap because I don't know how to play a game. Oh, the path. This is on the wrong side. That's fine. That's fine. Because um, we're going to build the bigger ones anyway. Uh, let's get um, start getting the science going again for a minute. Um, where is it? Here. Triple Floodgate is 500 science. Well, then, we are waiting patiently. We are waiting patiently. Um, in the meantime, need a couple of people pumping again. We're not going to run out of water. I'll tell you that right now. Which means we probably, we've got four buildings that don't have somebody working in them. But that's fine. I don't know where they would be, so... Let's go down to one here, maybe? I don't know. We've got four babies about to grow up, so I think we'll be alright. Do want to keep an eye on everything. Oh, all these are done? Very good. Does that mean these stairs are done? These stairs are done. Very awesome. We need to... We really... We have a couple of spare planks. Let's get this guy uh, on. And we'll go down to, to one beep. Beaver there. Perfect. I like it. Uh, well, we have one spare beaver. I really need everybody working. Make sure that's at one, and it is. I don't really know if we need that guy working. But we do need a lumberjack, unfortunately. Actually, we need a couple of things and, and uh, 
So we have to wait patiently. Yeah, we need a couple more beavers to be working. I mean, this is kind of a waste. Let's pause this guy for now. Who else is... How many builders do we have? Just the one. Pause this. Yeah, that'll be good. Now we've got everybody working that I need to be working, technically. And then um, we'll move on from here. We've almost got the 500 science. It's like one an hour, so it's going to take quite a bit of time. But we have three gears. What was it that we wanted the gears for? Well, probably for the engine. That's metal. So there was something we needed gears for. Um, but I don't remember. So, where is metal? Because maybe that's coming up. Nowhere close. The closest one's right there, which is actually... Let me take a look. Is just out of range, probably. Unless we make a direct... Let's make a direct route through here just to see... Where it takes us. We'll see where that takes us. We also... Oh, the drought's coming. We could also... Um, let's raise this a half. See if that causes flooding. Oh, it does. Okay, all right. we already know it does. Stop. stop, stop, stop. Don't do that. <clears throat> because the path is on the wrong side. Right. I remember. I'm sorry. Golly, my memory is so terrible I can't remember things three seconds ago. But let's just assign this a little bit higher of a priority. Just so we can see if that path will go through. And then I think I want to get rid of these stairs and get those in there. And a lot of this is not going to happen very soon. But oh we've got two spare beavers. Um Well uh, Make planks. Oh, we've got as many gears as we can get. So, let's pause that. We need our forester. We need this guy to be working, and we need this guy to be working. Um, but apparently we, we don't have as many beavers as I thought, because uh, Voyabambi, Voyambi, Voyambi died of old age, unfortunately. So, we're down. What I thought was a spare beaver is now... No longer spare. Does this go like this? Okay. Well, we'll let this guy take care of those trees, and uh, and we'll be back before we'll be back faster than you can uh, shake a stick at a beaver. You know, be back. <laughs>